hello guys you welcome back again to my channel if today is your first time thank you so much for tuning in and to my returning viewers and subscribers thank you so much for your support should in case you haven't subscribed to my channel please do consider subscribing and if you want to see more of these same posts please turn on the notification bell so that whenever i post a video you'll be the first person to be notified so guys today <laughs> if you are from urobo just come make we settle this matter yes urobo of wavo urobo mena of wavo so today guys I will be talking about the Urobo Orere Ijesa, which was later, okay, which was later changed to Urobo Orere Ivesa. That is the Urobo National Anthem of 1949. So, guys, just for the purpose of those that doesn't know about this particular song and the composer of this song or the person whom it was composed on behalf of so guys today i'll be talking about the urobo orere ijesa song which was composed as early as 1949 so the song later became widely accepted and even gained an audience as urobo national anthem just like the country's national anthem, okay? So, let's talk about Shiv Jesa Ogboru. Shiv Jesa Ogboru, for whose reason this song was composed, okay? It was the second Urobo with the title of Honorable after Shiv Mowo Mukoro. At the time, Mowo died in 1948. Shiv Jesa Ogboru succeeded him in 1949. So, I want you to also understand that Mowo was the first Urobo elected member of the Western House of Assembly and represented the whole of Wari Province, okay? Under Mowo, the first major third road in Wari Province, which is the Wari Sapele Road, was third. You guys all know the Wari Sapele Road, Abi, and when here, Abi. Unfortunately, Chief Mowo died quite early, and Chief Jesa Ogboru became Urobo Megaphone thereafter. It should be noted that the majority of Urobo people render it as Urobo Orere Iviesa. I told you guys before, it was Urobo Orere Iviesa okay which was later changed okay so the images of chief jesa better the declaration song okay urobo orere ijesa which later gave way to his present lyrics it was first sung in 1949 in honor of chief jesa ogboru who succeeded chief mowo Mukoro in the Western House of Assembly. The opening line was Urobo Orere Ijesa, now Orere Iviesa. It is comp its composers were drawn from all works of life, that is the Urobo as a whole. Presently, it has been accepted as the national anthem of the largest ethnic nationality in Delta State, which is the Urobo people. So, if you are coming across this video for the first time, and if you have any other thing to add to what I've just said, just be free to do what? To add to it. And let me sing the song for the sake of people that doesn't know it. If you don't know, I be Urobo. And so I go to sing the song. And if you still have another uh, version of it, you can put it. Because in Urobo, we have different dialects. And my own dialect is Udu. So I'm speaking Udu. And this is how we sing it in Udu. And if you have the lyrics, you can post it in the comment section for other people to also know how to sing it. So you can flow with the song, whichever way, whichever dialect you used to sing it, it is acceptable, okay? So just listen, oh, my people. Mm -hmm. Ko, 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 bare, urobo e, 
Olele ivye sao. E malu robo kokole akbale. Urobo e. Olele ivye sa. Oboru robo jewe na asafa jewa tia e ao. E defa meke akbo. Urobo me ware. Urobo e. Olele ivye sao. Anyo ma. Mini koko koko akbale. Urobo e. Olele ivye sao. Mini koko koko akbale. Urobo e. Olele ivye sa. Eke alu robo jewe na ola fa jewa ti ya ya o. E de fa me ke akpo ota alu robo me ware. U robo e. Olele ivye sa o. So guys, that is it. If you have the lyrics, feel free to drop it in the comment section. I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.